It's not easy being me we'll Wash your face and brush your hair we'll Nag, 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 it's just not fair I'm Horrid Henry Sometime we're school, I'm gonna rule And when I'm king, I'll do my thing And then my life will be so sweet I'm Horrid Henry Na, 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 na The purple hand gang rules, okay so easy being me, I'm Horrid Henry. Every time I write a note to your parents, Henry, it seems to mysteriously disappear. This time I'm taking no chances. Oh, hello, Miss Battleaxe. Oh, what did he do this time? Totally disrupted the class. What do you have to say for yourself? Wasn't me? Get in the house, Henry! You're late! Out of my way, worm! Henry, where do you think you're going? To my room for the rest of my life! No, you can't go to your room. Huh? Why not? Because we're going out to dinner at a fancy grown-up restaurant! Fancy restaurant? No way! Not me! I've been bad! I should be sent to my room! Not tonight. You're going to have a bath and change your clothes. A bath? Now? No! <coughs> we could get a babysitter. No, we're going out as a family. <coughs> Henry! He's got the car keys again. I'm coming in there. <laughs> Henry, no! Not the toilet! He wouldn't, would he? <sighs> you didn't see that, Peter. Right, let's go. I can't wait! A chance to try new things! I love food. Well, um, all except beetroot. I love food too. Well, all except squid. Oh, and Dad doesn't like tomatoes. Well, I don't like anything except Whoopa Whoopi Burgers. I'm not going! That's that! All right, Henry, here's the deal. You come along, behave yourself, and eat everything on your plate, and I'll give you two pounds. Two pounds? Just for shoving a few mouthfuls of disgusting food in my mouth. Normally I have to do that for free. How about three pounds? Don't push it, Henry. OK, deal. What's my reward for being good? Goodness is its own reward, Peter, darling. Huh? It's very nice of Aunt Ruby to invite us to dinner at Restaurant La Poche. It won't be as good as Whopper Whoopi. They have real food. And your cousin Steve will be there too, boys. Oh, no! Not stuck up Steve! <laughs> Where shall I park? We park, sir, unless you happen to be the chauffeur. Darlings! Oh, Ruby! <laughs> New car, Ruby? Oh, I'm not sure, darling. All our limos look the same to me. <laughs> What make is your car, Henry? Russ Bucket 2000? <laughs> Thank you, sir. Oh, look at that! Yes, isn't it fabulous? It's carved completely out of ice. I didn't think you'd be coming, Henry. I'm getting two pounds for eating everything on my plate. And I'm not getting anything because goodness is its own reward. Huh? Be, Be quiet, quiet, worm! I thought 
this place was called La Push. It don't seem very posh to me. Shh! You're shouting. Don't tell me I'm shouting, Boudicca Battleaxe. I'll tell you if I'm shouting. Shh! Mother! Wow! I didn't think teachers had mothers. So, what's everyone having? I recommend... <coughs> Le de cochon avec les yeux du mouton. Oh. Oh, don't they know any English? It's a French restaurant, stupid. Um, you order for me, Aunt Ruby. I eat everything. Yes, perhaps Aunt Ruby should order for all of us. Excellent idea. No way! I've got to eat everything on my plate, so I'm ordering for myself. Which one is the hamburger and chips? That would be on the lunch menu, monsieur, and we do not open for lunch. I dare you to order escargot as an appetizer. <laughs> escargot? What's that? Snails. <laughs> yeah, right. Like they're going to serve snails in a fancy restaurant. And then try it for your main course. That's sheep's intestines. But if you're chicken... Don't call me chicken. <laughs> I'll have escargot and tripe. Hmm, our speciality. Very good, monsieur. Et voilà! Oh, gross! Let's see you eat that! <laughs> Two pounds, Henry, two pounds. Mm -mm. Not bad. Tastes like chewing gum. Oh, oh. Steve, they're so scrumptious. Oh. <laughs> oh. Bernica, stop slurping. Yes, Mother. And eat your vegetables. Yes, Mother. Uh, Henry. Good evening, Miss Badlux. I hope you have a scrumptious meal. My, what nice manners. He didn't learn those in your class, I'm sure. The sauce poche is too hot and spicy for the English tummy. Perhaps Monsieur is uh, lust? No, no. Uh, my, my cousin forgot to ask for some le sauce poche on his food. I was going to tell the cook. You have told me. I will inform the chef. Good. My cousin really likes spicy food. At least five drops. Yes! Close your mouth, Boudica. I swear I can see right down your gullet. Mother! Excuse me, young man. I hope my daughter is teaching you properly. Mother! Oh, yes, Mom. She does. Goodbye. Oh, that lovely boy. He's so sweet. But, Mother, he's the most horrid boy in my class. And whose fault is that? Finally. Our dinner is here. Oh, look. Squid. I don't like squid. And I don't like tomatoes. And I don't like beetroots. Oh, Aunt Ruby, you ordered their favourites. Oh, it's so nice to be appreciated. I'm sure you will all enjoy every mouthful. And for Monsieur, the speciality of the house, tripe. I wouldn't eat that. Not even for two pound. <laughs> Once you've eaten a snail, you can eat anything. Ah, delicious. Eat up, everyone. This is real food. Ah, uh, yes. How's your extra hot sauce, Steve? this instant! <laughs> Madame, you must leave. Your son has caused a great disruption. Well, 
I'm certainly not staying where I'm not wanted. Neither am I. Bye-bye, Beetroot. But you said I have to finish everything on my plate. Here's your two pounds, Henry. Now, let's go and find some real food. Well done, young man. So polite. Not like your young friend. <laughs> Whoppa, whoopee! Here we come! <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Yeah, yeah, yeah! <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> I'll get you, Henry! Time Vortex Manipulator! Check! <laughs> Deep Maxulation Drive! Check! will be here soon to talk about the school play costumes. Miss Lovely! Oh, goody! Let's make the box into a little cottage just for her! Now, I'm just popping next door for a minute, so Henry, behave! Oh, we could uh, cut out windows here, paint flowers and... No! Don't you touch my box! It's a time machine, you toad! It is not. It's made of cardboard and a new washing machine came in it. If it looked like a time machine, everyone would try and steal it. Don't you know anything? It's in disguise. No! It's top secret! Well, if it is a time machine, then I want to have a go. You can't. You're too young. I'm not. And I don't believe you anyway. Then watch this. I'll prove it's a time machine by travelling to the future. Stand back. You don't want to get scorched by the Vortex Blast. I don't believe you're going to the future. Whoa! The Vortex! Ah! Into the future! stuck in the future. What if he never comes back? I could watch whatever I want on TV. Whoa! house and he looks just like me. So he's ugly. What did you say? Uh, uh nothing. Uh, uh, what's it like in the future, Henry? Horrible. Uh, I mean, horrible. Everybody just eats vegetables. All the boys wear dresses. 
and everybody talks in Ugg language. Ugg? Bibble Ugg Blay? Oh, oh, second wait, wait. Lolly Nyub? And kids have loads of homework. Ooh, homework? I'm going to the future. I want to see it for myself. Uh, Peter? You can't stop me, Henry. But, Peter, you can't go like that. They'll laugh at you. Oh, no. Wait there. Right. Now you look just like a boy from the future. You won't be able to speak Bibble Babble language unless you drink this Bibble Babble drink. I'm ready. Now remember, when you arrive, count to ten before you come out. Don't want bits of you to end up in the wrong century. Goodbye.
I'll get it. <gasps> Hello, Miss Lovely. Hello, Peter. Oh, don't you look lovely in your costume? All ready for the school play. Oh, yes, Miss Lovely. Oh, and Henry? I see you're in costume as well. You can be in the play too. No way! I'm not getting all dressed up in front of everybody. <laughs> <laughs> I know just part for you. Yeah, Henry. 